Ni hao. Hello. Ni hao. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Naim Faz and I come from Pakistan. Dear customers, fans and friends. Hello. Ni hao. I came to China in 2011 and I started my Bachelor of Mechanical Engineering but right now I am in China, Shuzhou and working in XCMG group and uh, I am working here as a product manager I know better about the machine. I can introduce them in a technical way. China is providing its own infrastructure experience and mechanical equipments to Pakistan, Turkey, and other the Belt and Road Projects countries. This is the Diyama Basha hydropower station, the largest water conservancy project under construction in Pakistan. It can generate 4,500 megawatts of electricity. Last year, I went there to provide our product training and uh, the engineers and the other construction staff, they were very happy to see our machines because our machine has uh, latest technology which, which will help them to boost their construction work and uh, finish it on time. Hen In the Pakistan whole country, it is lack of electricity. The summertime, the temperature is around 45 to degree, 50 degrees centigrade. If we don't use AC or fan, it is uh, difficult to live in the room. China and Pakistan has a cooperation to build the Basha Dam. It is a keen project for the peoples of Pakistan. So when this project will be completed, it will be a very great chance for the both both sides, uh, for the prosperity of the people. In his famous work, The Wealth of Nations, Adam Smith states that the erection and maintenance of the public works which facilitate the commerce of any country, such as good roads, bridges, navigable canals, harbors, etc., must require very different degrees of expense in the different periods of society. Infrastructure construction and large engineering projects require powerful tools and equipment.它已经完全超出了我们这个常规履带起重机的一个设计的思路。我是负责世界第一雕壁架系统的设计研发，我叫崔丹丹。世界第一雕，呃，现在说起来挺轻松的，当时参与这个设计的研发团队有一百多人，
，我们的工程机械产品可以为“一带一路”很多国家的基础设施建设提供最先进的施工工具和手段，保证他们的施工质量和进度，从而促进他们国民经济的发展。原来以为“一带一路”呢，就是中国周边这些国家，但是很快它受到了全球的欢迎。这个环境啊，非常不同，这个条件差异很大。最近几年。我们提出了“一带一路”的板块化，根据不同的区域、不同的自然条件和社会情况和产业发展的水平，形成了不同板块，像东南亚板块、中亚板块、中东板块、中东欧板块等等，不是一个全球的“一带一路”千篇一律，那是不可能的。特别像东南亚板块呢，现在做得比较好，它不仅硬件连接、产业连接，还有规则。今年是“一带一路”的十周年，我们的工程机械可以帮助“一带一路”很多国家建设他们的公路、铁路、桥梁、港口。这些基础设施建成之后，可以有效地帮助他们国家之间实现人流物流的畅通，实现国家与国家之间的互通互联。高质量呢，就是说，第一，不能限于基础设施，基础设施一定要和产业链。和整个制造业的发展结合，只有路没有产业，这个路是空的，这个路也不能收回成本。Infrastructure is the cornerstone of interconnectivity. It is also the bottleneck in the development of developing countries. Infrastructure construction can effectively shore up weak spots in development and promote more countries to release economic development momentum. My name is Iskandirov Aziz. I'm from Kazakhstan. I'm Vice General Manager in Leningrad, China, Kazakhstan International Logistic Company. It's Kazakhstan faced with problems such as boarding container in a border area. Leningrad, China, Kazakhstan Logistics Terminal was established in 2014 in June, and this. Uh, Project the Belt and Road already helped solve a lot of problems in logistics sphere for Kazakhstan, for Central Central Asia, Caucasus region, Turkey, and Europe too. 一带一路对各个地区的发展推动的主要的方面也不一样。像在中亚地区呢，主要是解决中亚地区和外部的联络，中哈。物流基地，这是一条捷径，一条最快的路线，使他们比较快的变成陆海连接的国家。Previously, it took around the 30 days by the sea reach to Istanbul, Turkey, but it takes only 14 days reach Istanbul by the train from our base. China Kazakhstan International Logistics Base helps provide the shortest route to the Asia Pacific market. Since from official uh, operation in 2014, we already completed 30 million tons of goods and uh, around uh, 1.7 million containers. I hope in the future we make better speed of send our goods and will become the ocean gateway for the more inland countries by opening more scheduled uh, international block train and uh, optimizing the agent service for the whole transport. Lianyungang, we call it Asia Dalu Road's starting point. 它实际上是一个陆海联运的物流基地，也就是说，中国东部沿海要转向欧洲，在连云港这儿换装、重组、编组，这是一方面。第二方面呢，我们看到韩国和日本的物流啊，要进入欧亚大陆桥到欧洲，这是一个新的陆海联运，是东亚和欧洲西欧市场在海上和陆上结合，中哈。
物流基地呢，实际上代表着中亚和东亚两个市场的高度连接。Around 60% of Kazakhstan trades with the East and the South Asia, such as the mineral resources. Channel enable more conventional transport of the Kazakhstan ferrolabs and chrysolithite abesto to Japan, South Asia. It provides plenty of employment, appointments, development for business, and better quality of the life for the local people. For 10 years, the Belt and Road Initiative has galvanized nearly 1 trillion US dollars of investment, established more than 3,000 cooperation projects, created 420,000 local jobs, and helped lift almost 40 million people out of poverty. The BRI has evolved from vision into reality, boosting development in partner countries and bringing real benefits to the people.